Now at noon, a new process for a new reality. What's changing today at the DMV? What you need to know that voter ID is now in effect for the November election. And good afternoon, I'm Vince Vetrano. You're watching live at noon. The new law will require all voters to provide a photo ID at the polls. Today, the state launched a new initiative to help people get IDs if they do not have documentation. Jonah Kaplan explains. Driver's licenses, passports, student IDs, all of them already have a vote of approval at the polls. This new process is for those who lack any ID and the documentation necessary to apply for it. Voting is a right. It's not a privilege like our driver's products are. The DMV today printed out a new form for those without a birth certificate, enabling applicants to skip a trip to the courthouse and skip the cost that usually comes with it. We then take that petition and we forward it to Department of Health Services, who is then going to verify your name and date of birth. We also, before you leave the office, will verify that your social security number matches your name and date of birth. We have a system hooked up with social security that verifies, makes that verification. The forms still require specific birth information, like the place of birth and the full names of both parents. Those interested also can't come empty handed. They would need to provide us with some form of their residency, utility bills, bank statements, Along with proof of residency, they would need to show us some proof of what we call identity. That would be like social security card, student ID, work ID. As for how long it will take to get from form to actual ID, DMV representatives say really it all depends how long it takes DHS to process the information. So if you want that ID before November 4th, Election Day, just make sure the sooner the better. In Milwaukee, Jonah Kaplan, today's TMJ4. Jonah, thank you. Naturalized citizens without birth certificates can also fill out a petition, but applicants must prov prov provide a citizenship certificate number.